All right, let's go exploring again. Let's head back out into the world, see what's what. What's what over here is nothing. <laughs> we can do nothing there. Well, hey there, traveler. Hi. Hi there. Don't mind the beast. She don't like strangers. The mountain don't neither. You be careful. I'll try. Thanks. Careful is my middle name. Foothill Falls. What's your name, lad? If I'm to hold a grudge, best to know the name. I'm Cal. This is BD1. My bantam old mum dubbed me Scuba Stev. Scuba the Fisher, am I? You know, there's a fish tank down in Pylon Saloon that could use some attention. Pylon Saloon? That'll ever infest in watering hole down in your valley. All right, all right. You know, yeah. Ah, fine, twist my arm. I'll do it. <laughs> Maybe at the saloon and we'll appraise this so called. Tank. Awesome. Scuva recruited. Cool. Master fisherman obsessed with his craft, fount of wisdom, knowledge, and encouragement, as long as the topic is fishing. <laughs> what a great character design. I love that. Ah, can you could have stay away? You don't even sing the seas play once it's missed in your gums. I guess not. You're the aspect of a fisher lad. And uh, lucky for you. We're perched just above the layer of the sea fish. Sea fish, huh? That's right. An impossible catch. No fisher in the right mind would pursue such a quarrelsome fool. No fisher, but Scuba Stev. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible. Where are we on the map right now? Oh, that was quick. Did you get it? Oh, you got it. <laughs> you see that one? That was pretty impressive. Looks like that. May not be the rarest of all fish, but it's nevertheless a tricky creature to catch on account of its agility. Sure. You still think I'm small time, eh? No, I believe well, then, I've no choice but to regale you with my bleak most history. Tell me a moment, and I'll tell you a thing or two about old Scuba Stan. All right. So, you wish to prick up your ears and receive the tale of Scuba? If you're sharing stories, we'll listen. Then you be a fool, my lad. A sordid tale will bring you nothing but grief and woe. <laughs> okay, well, if you're not sharing stories, we'll... Oh, fine, I'll tell you. At your own assistance, and at your own peril. My story begins in a small village on the frozen banks of Sakavi Tan. My home world. Nights black as quellfish in it. Winter so cold, a stern look could turn you to glass. Doesn't sound like the easiest place to grow up. Difficult, eh? From the moment your mother's milk froze on your tongue <laughs> to the moment you found it on frozen streets. You see, the fishes, they had the right of it. They dwelt far below the ice, where warm currents danced like ribbons in the wind. A fish so scarce a quarry. On account of the great fish famine, well, it's nearly a mild undertaking. But for all the belly aching now, there's a peaceful enough life for a wee Sakavian with an instinct for the rod. So you discovered your talent early. Such a talent was I, that as a lad, me hardly spotted my first prickly chin here. I was given an audience with Undun. But that'd be a tale for another time. How about right now? Oh, and uh, some advice, lad. If you're planning to scale the mountain, you'll need to give a strong grip. You won't regale me with the rest of the tale right now? Boo. I want to hear it. I want to hear it. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're up here. Knew it. Knew there'd be a chest. Gimme, give gimme. Give Yoink. 
It's a new pummel. Oh, isn't that the pummel that for the set that we're using right now? I think it might be. Okay, where's this going? Is this like... Okay, this is a whole thing. I thought... Okay, whatever. Let's just keep going. Let's see what's up ahead, buddy. The Mountain Ascent. Let's keep moving, buddy. Got him! Won't be easy. Think of the rewards, Shanna. Come on. Okay. Braving the heights. Two prospectors. Uh, we're determined. Sure. <laughs> More priorite. Wonder what this will fetch a dumbest shot. Uh, wait. Was this? I guess this is a dead end. I thought that was the way to go, but. There's a way to go up here, but we can't get through that door, so... Hmm. Exception. You smell that scum? That's imperial air you're breathing. So get back before I forget my orders and we see how tough you really are. Why don't you drop the shield and we'll find it? You will lower the shield. I. Uh. I'm authorized, mate. I already showed you my authorization. You already showed me your authorization. Uh, sir? TK-783 to base command. Lower the shield. <laughs> what? Wait, what? <laughs> LOL! Shouldn't have done that, mate. <laughs> Press down to slice and control damaged KX series security droids. What? Huh. Interesting. Okay. And they fight on my side. Cool. Well, did we have something like that in the first game? I actually can't remember. Now, is this... Is that the end of it? Is this a dead end? I mean, that's a red wall. So that implies that is GG. There's nothing over here. I think that's the end of it then. Well, then why is there... If that is the end of it, then why would there be a meditation spot here for us to fast travel back to? So I feel like it must there must be something more we can do later. Maybe that maybe we get the ability to walk through these walls later or some shit. And I'm not missing a way to go up here, am I? Nothing I can climb. No, it seems like that is it. Oakley Dokley. Nothing around here. There is stuff over there, and I haven't been over there. Not sure how I would get over there, however. Nothing here. Oh, 
careful. There's nothing to worry. Whoa! Huh? I got you, Shanna. Thanks. A curious pair. One slipped and saved by the other. Nice, nice. Were you here what? before? Who are you? Who are you? I didn't think you were there before, were you? I hear you, BD. Let's see. Uh, prospectors have envisioned many grand projects. Elevator was somehow completed successfully. Okay, so can we open this then? Can't use this lift from here. Boo. Well, I don't know where we use it from then, but I guess we can come back here. We can get back here some other way. How do I get out? Oh. <laughs> Alright, well that's all we can do here for now then, I think. Yeah, unsure how we get around here. Can't go further right, can we? Not currently. Hmm. Yeah, not sure. We will be back here at a later time then. Found items? Why does it pop up with that? Not sure. Okay, so... Uh, there's three doors over here. And there's two doors over the right-hand side. Also, apparently I missed a big-ass door right here. Hmm. I am quite tempted to go and check these places out. What's that? Oh, meditation point. And that? Oh, workbench. Okay. Uh, hmm. Is this the right direction, roughly? Slightly to the left. Let's check out these ones around here. And then we'll probably do the other ones further further to the right or another time. Because I do also want to progress the story, of course. Can go in there? No. How far away is this thing? Uh, is it even going to be easy to get into? Maybe not. Maybe not. Hmm. Oh, hey! <laughs> Tis only Cal. Forgive the short greeting, lad. I'm always on edge when fishing for the finger lipped Garpon. What a name. And fierce as they come. That doesn't need to turn the poachers. The poor Garpon, despite its rarity, is a delicacy for the black of heart and the rumbly of belly. In we go! Yeet. <laughs> I love this guy, man. He's great. He's so good. Ah, did you see that beauty? Two plump fins. A fine compliment to glands. <laughs> A scrumptious, varicose tongue. <laughs> Long digit-like lower lip that protrudes dramatically ahead of it. Traverses bodies of water by gliding as close to the bottom as possible, unknown how it survived for so long. Seems entirely at the mercy of both predators and culinarians. Fishing on an empty stomach, Scuva? Hey, I can't succumb to the passions of the stomach. The carpon must live. I'd better get me mind off it. Then spin your tail. Where are we? Ah, yes. By virtue of my prodigious fishing talents, I was taken to see the mysterious one they call Undun. I can see it still. We scuba ushered into young black mouth cave. I could barely make out the figure glinting with moonlight. I scrubbed my eyes like a, a old tar scrubbing the deck. And there she was. A vast creature. Great tentacles blooming from her blubber, like cables gorging on a fuel tank. 
<laughs> One of the tentacles twitched into the air, just over my head, and then, wham! Right on the noggin, so I'm told. I staggered out the cave like a lover first acquainted with a deck. But something else happened. I think, when that fell tentacle struck me, Undone took something straight out to me brain and put something else in. She put something in your brain? Aye, boy. The subtle art of catching a fish. The art of focus. And in the dark, with nothing but the bristles on your chin for company, that focus is special. From that day forward, when I plunge my line into the frigid waters, it would emerge with a fish. Three times out of seven. <laughs> That's less than half. My village told me that I'd be the one to save them from the great fish famine. Little did I know that the grapnel was soon to arrive on our shores. Gonna assume that's a bad thing. Perhaps not. And perhaps not. But that'll be a story for another time. Sure. Man, this guy is the best. <laughs> I love everything that he says. And he can talk for fucking forever, so that's good. We never did find a way to get to this, did we? No. Well, I'm not going to waste a bunch more time trying. Uh, okay. So, I don't know how we get up. I don't know how we get up to the higher bit over here. Like, that lowering would be a good start, but I'm not sure how to make that happen. So, I think for now we'll just move on. I wonder how long this has been here. Thanks for the prior right. Uh, okay, so we haven't actually looked at this bit. Let's look at this bit real quick. We've come out that cave. We have not checked out this. That's not a cave, that's just a tunnel. Okay, so this is stuff that we can't access yet. What about up the stairs over here? <coughs> nice. Skills. Uh, I feel like this is going to be a landing pad we can put our own ship on or something at some point, but currently no. Another one of you? Okay. Well, that went not great. But we didn't die, so, you know, it's fine. Hmm, I didn't expect to actually be able to walk up this. Anything over here? Not really. But we can go up there. I think. There you are. Oh, hi. Not getting through. Seriously. You piece of shit. Can we eat ourselves up here? Maybe not. Oh, maybe so.
Anything of interest up here? Seed, okay. Dathomirian? What's the fucking Dathomirian seed doing here? Oh, you're friendly? Okay. I'm looking. The Relta egg. Typically, Relters do not leave their eggs unguarded for long. However, the rise of the Bedlam Raiders on Kobo, the valley ecosystem has caused Relters to fly further and longer in search of food. Sanj. What the fuck is a Dathomirian plant doing here, though? Are we going back to Dathomir? Maybe Malakos is somehow still alive. I kind of hope so, not gonna lie. I did like old Malakos. Uh, can I get over here at all? I think if jumping down there would give me any benefit. That is such a cool skybox. I don't think it does, does it? Alright. Bonk. Let us head in the direction of story. Three gates, two gates, both ahead. Surprise! A wound is just a wound. Oh. You're gonna destroy me now, aren't you? Sure am. And then was the other way more of the same? Feeling so great, PD. The other way led down there. And then I wouldn't have had this meditation point, so I guess I chose right. Lovely jubbly, cheeky rest. Still need one more skill point to buy All the set. skill that I want. I thought that was something chasing me for a second there. Oh, hello. I see that dude. That dude looks angry. Hmm. So over there is progress. Not sure how we get over there. Should we check up here? Embarrassing for you, mate. Won't be locked for long. Boobity boo. Tactical trousers. Oh, we got material for them. Right. What trousers are we wearing? We're wearing survivor trousers. But we could wear the tactical trousers. Wait, I didn't save. How does that look? Nah, it's not right. That's not right. Uh, do, do, do. 
Honestly, that's probably what goes with the outfit the best. Yeah. Or does it? Eh, actually, it kind of doesn't. Let's go with that. I prefer that. Hi there. Uh, do I have to fight you? I feel like I may have to. I can also go down there. There is a cave there. Should we just fight you? Let's just fight you. I need to get to that. Hello, friend. We're all friends here, right? Ow. Toss me, OPD. I think when it, I think I could have like, oh god, I think I could have um. Oh, I keep pressing the bumper instead of the fucking... I don't know how that didn't hit me. Whoops. Help, please. There we go. It's right trigger. I keep pressing right bumper. That's wrong. What's that, bud? The bile more. Large, thick-hided bile moor made its home amongst Kobo's many crags, cra caves, and crevices. When disturbed, they react fiercely. Uh, hard exterior resistance to most conventional weaponry. Yeah, that's all good. All good. Uh, what can we make use of this for? Wait, where was the thing? Wasn't there a thing? Oh, it's up there. Huh. Okay, how do we get to that then? Hmm. How do we get to that? What? Check it out, BD. Okay, that's all that's in here. How the fuck do we get up there? Oh, wait, you can jump higher. I see. I had not noticed that. There we go. What is this one? It do be a health increase. Very nice. Very, very nice. the other side. Oh, hello. What the fuck is this? Oh. Hello. B1 melee battle droids. Backbone of the Separatist infantry, blaster rifles, Makeshift batons, tactical programming. 
Yeah. Sounds about right. Okay. Um, is there a way for me to knock a shortcut down? Because I really want to... Is that a shortcut, actually? Because I really want to go and see what's behind that waterfall, but I don't want to go all the way back around. Is this going to be a shortcut? Hey, there it is. Love that. I'll never give in. The galaxy will know our story. Stand up to me. It's Stuart. Not bad. What's happening? Try me a river. Okay. So the other path, yeah, it led down here. Seed, okay. What the fuck is this? This is strange. Hello? <laughs> what have we discovered here? What the fuck is this? Fractured resolve. Use your skills to reach the goal. Do we have a time limit? I see the timer's ticking up, but I don't know if... I don't know if there's an actual limit or... Oh, it's every time I jump it switches. I see. Okay. That's really cool, actually. I really like that. That's a really cool idea. Oh god, these are all shifting. Yo, that was sick! That's awesome! I need to find more of those. I don't know, BD. It was an echo oh, wow. in the force, but wounded, fragmented. I was missing something. Whatever I did, it seems to have helped. Got a full level from that. That's crazy. That's huge. What a good reward. Oh, love the flip. Man, that was awesome. I hope we find loads more of those. That was so much fun. Just a tiny little fucking skill challenge thingy. Alright, what were we going for? Uh, not you. We were going for you, right? LB, right before a bolt hits, to split it and reflect it at additional targets. Yes. All about that. That's going to be big. Okay, um, and then from there we can go up here. Oh, what's the prerequisite for that? This one? Twin Vipers. L, B, and Y, then Y again to throw the second blade at a target. So wait, is this... This was L, B. Oh no, this is L, B, and X. L, B, and Y. Okay, let's have a look. Let's view it. Can I do that currently? Like, can I do the one currently? Ah, okay, yeah, I didn't know I could do that. You're going down. Nice. Vom vom. Cool, yeah. Alright, that uses that uses force, right, of course. Focus. That is, I think, a good point to uh leave off for the day, I believe. Man, this game okay. is really good. This I'm game ready. is really, really, really good. I'm loving it. I wish the performance was better. Because that is the only issue. But it's like a pretty big issue. 
And, like, if they just delayed it a few months, if AIA had let them delay it a few months, then this game would be, like, amazing, amazing. But, I mean, I'm sure you've seen, but, like, the Steam reviews for it right now are, like, overwhelmingly negative and stuff because of the, uh, because of the tech issues. And it's like, I get that all EA cares about is short-term profits, but, like, fuck, man. Could you not just delay it a few months? And then you get... Like, it's only a few months. You're still getting your profits real soon. But also, it comes with overwhelmingly positive reviews. And then you sell more. And you build up that brand trust and shit. And it's like, no. You're just going to shove it out the door a few months too early. So that it's got all these performance hiccups and stuff. And it's just it's, it's just disappointing, man. But uh, overall, it is a fantastic game. Aside from that issue. And uh, yeah, I'm having a great time having a great time with it. Hope you're having a great time watching it. If you are, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you next time for more Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Thanks for watching. See you then.